So in the news, the Oshun State Governor, Boyegao Yatola, has inaugurated the newly reconstructed Adai Bajo Road after 33 years of neglect. The road, which was first constructed under the defunct Western Region by the then Premier, the late Chief Obafemi Awolowo, in the mid-50s and reconstructed in 1987-88, had become a death trap for motorists and residents of the Axis, particularly peasant farmers, whose means of livelihood uh, depended, uh, depended rather on the state of the road. Governor Itala described the gesture as a fulfillment of yet another promise made. The commission is a welcome addition to the social economic development of our town, our state, and that job, and other in particular. We are happy to report that this road was completed at record time and in line with our proof specifications. This leads our promise to live by our words and never to compromise quality under any guys. I urge you to take advantage of this road to improve our meaningful agricultural trading and entrepreneurial efforts for personal and socioeconomic development. Earlier, the Commissioner for Works and Transport, Engineer Remy Omoaye, said it was noteworthy that the road was approved at a time it had become highly impassable for users, particularly the farmers, whose means of livelihood depend on it. Meanwhile, the contractor who handled the project said the road has a 15-year lifespan, assuring that if properly ma maintained, it will serve for more than 20 years. This road is very important because Igbajo is historic in the history of Yoruba land. Um, it's, uh, there are special people and getting to this town has been a lot of issues. Uh, but we thank God that today um, this road has been fully reconstructed today and we are here to celebrate the commission. And part of what we are doing as a government is to ensure that we open up a lot of our town, we link up our town. So this is one of the link rope. Linking Igbajo, linking Igbajo to Hada. So this road has been in use for the past 11 months. And from what you have seen, you see that the quality is very high. There has not been any major maintenance in the places where we need to put safety measures. The safety measures are there and the road has met specification. There are other access roads that lead to the town, but this is our main road. And, it has, and the the first state of the road has been impeding a lot of commercial activities and a lot of uh, uh, development in the, uh, in the town. And since uh, Governor Etola has done this road, everything, commercial activities, everything has improved. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.